Please both passengers here before departure at 11.44. Hey everyone, welcome back to Train Sim, this time we're in a pacer. So, math key in. Press it. Press it to neutral, we set the AWS, lower passengers. Set the destination to Newcastle, so that's 164. Enter. Put the headlights to the day position. Uh, I think that's it. So today we're taking train one. Weather N is, I think it's Nike, one at Nike six zero. The ten twenty three Carlisle to Newcastle train calling at Carlisle, Wetherall, Altwistle, Barton Hill, Heaton Bridge, Hexham, Prudhoe, Metro Centre, and at Newcastle. The next stop is at Newcastle, arriving at eleven fifty five. So it's passing in Metro Centre, the speed limit is 40 miles per hour and it's and it's going down to 25 miles per hour when we pass Dalston. So the, on the date of recording this video, so that's the 24th of July, um, this marks one year of making videos public, making public videos. So that's good, I guess. I, mean, I really enjoy making videos. I don't, I don't know what to say about it. Also, at the moment, the temperature in the UK is boiling. I think yesterday it was about 29 Celsius and today it's about 23. But for the UK it's pretty warm. They've been sweating all day, I can't stop. So now we're at 40 miles an hour, cut the power back so we can just coast. I mean, how can people like the warm weather? I hate it. It's well all the time, you stink, and, every, and just end up sticking to everything. Also, we, and when you sit down in a chair, when you leave, there's like a little puddle there. <laughs> there's like a little puddle on the chair, because you sweat so much, it kind of accumulates on the chair. I prefer, I prefer cold weather. Also, in warm weather, all you have is like bees and wasps that try to sting you for no reason. In winter, you don't sweat, so you don't stick to anything. Also, there's no insects, so it's colder as well, which means you can wear more clothes. I might slow down a bit too early. So we are now approaching Dalston Station. Expected past 11:48. You're early. Yeah, we're in a pacer. Because I assume this was this was on the train from Newcastle. You know the dot matrix one. What if I try to do different things? Email central. About well, this one. Welcome. One six. Oh, I'll put it back to Newcastle. One six. And oh, no, one six four was Newcastle. Leave us that. So speed limit is now going back up to 40 miles per hour. And I'll say that it'll stay like this until we get to a high bridge junction outside Newcastle. Hey, did anyone, in, did, did anyone else see the thunder and lightning on the morning of the 24th? Like, 20 past 2 in the morning? I did. 
Yeah, the cat who decided to be in the same room as me didn't really think much about it. She just went back to sleep. So we have a single yellow, which means we need to stop at the next signal. It was like 20 past 2 this morning, it was calm, and then 2 minutes later, it's like the world was ending. Like, torrential rain, thunder, like really loud thunder, like, like very bright lightning. So the next signal is just towards the end of this hill. So just slowing down so we don't um, go past the signal, or oh, spat. So I'll play a notch to a power so we don't end up rolling back down the incline. So the green is 1 to 50, so that's quite steep. I think you're just going to approach the signal at 5 miles an hour. So the reason why it's stuck at this signal is because an empty train has been passed in front of us into platform 3, 4, 4, and then I think we will work, work a train to King's Cross from there. So the empty train is from Newcastle to Newcastle, I don't know why it needed to change platforms, but we just get out of the way or something else. So we're going to Newcastle at 11.54 and a half. Yeah, we're not going to do that. So the approach the signal just took, just like crawling up to it. Yeah, I'm just going to park it here. So I'm going to cut the video here and then resume when we get a clear signal. Request the pass signal, danger approved. So now we can depart from here. So forward, but it's at 1, DRA off, and apply power. Oh yeah, I also put on the rear tail lights because I didn't do that. Alright, I forgot to do it. So we'll get to the top of here, the speed limit will go down to 25, no, 30. 30 miles down, then 15, where we enter the bay platform in Newcastle. 
there's a 150 to Carlisle. So because we had a signal past the danger, we probably need to stop with the next signal. Which I think is a double yellow. I think it's that one there. With a double yellow in it. This is the high level bridge that goes over the River Tyne. I think it's River Tyne. Maybe it's something else. I don't know. So our speed limit is going down to 15 as we traverse these points or junctions, whatever you want to call them. So we're now approaching Newcastle Station on the East Coast Main Line between King's Cross and Edinburgh. Speed limit is down 15 miles per hour. So on the right there's a 185 to Liverpool Lime Street, then there's an MT Class 91 set from Newcastle. And in front of us is another Transpennine train, but this time to Manchester Airport via Huddersfield and Manchester Victoria. Over the also called to Oxford Road and Piccadilly, and then to the airport. So this is it in a video, I hope you enjoyed me driving this really short journey. If you liked it, press like, maybe subscribe as well. So you don't miss out more Chainsim content. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Probably on Tuesday. Tuesday at 5pm should be. I'll have to change it. I probably won't know. And arrival at Newcastle.